All right. Hey, everyone. Welcome back to the Vegas Hockey Girls podcast, VGK News for Tuesday, July 2nd, episode 96. I'm Colleen. I'm Mandy. And we're sisters who have loved the <laughs> Vegas Golden Knights since day after one. one. <laughs> This is our first time being in different locations, so we're really excited, nervous, and all of the above. So our goal with the podcast is to get you 100% up to date with all things VGK in 15 minutes or less. So how did the battle-worn Authentics equipment sell go, sis? It was so badass. I got Aiden's glove. Wow. Yay. So I was super happy. There was a bunch of stuff there. Um, we got let in for 45 minutes. After the 45 minutes, we had to leave and they restocked it with other stuff. So, you know, so oh, so everybody kind of had a chance to get stuff. Yeah. Except for when I went in there, there were no goalie sticks. So. Oh, wow. Yeah. Let me ask you this. this. The clothing and all the equipment was set up on the ice. You weren't walking on ice, right? No, it was cement. I know. It looked like they drained the water or something. Yeah, I don't know how they get it out of there. <laughs> yeah, or maybe they just put, you know, there's flooring and stuff. All right, so you got Aiden's glove for how much? 50 bucks. Oh, my gosh. Do you love it or what? I love it. <laughs> yeah. Wow. So if you yeah. want to see pictures, they can look at your social media, I'm pretty sure. So I found out why I can't close the glove myself. It's because his glove is measured to his hand. Oh, wow. So that's why I'm not strong enough to close it. Obviously, his hand is way bigger than mine. Oh, wow. But yeah, that's, that's what I found out. Well, that's good to know. That's interesting. So we, go ahead. Char Charlie and Annie got the matching blocker. They got um, Logan's stick. They got Logan's black glove. Ashley got um, Aiden's blocker. Wow. So, yeah, we were all excited. We got all the goalie stuff. <laughs> and you got in early because season ticket holder took you in, huh? Yes. Thank you, Jay and Brandy, for letting me go. Yeah, that was amazing. All right. So we went to the NHL Awards, and that show was fill in the blank. Uh, it was cool. Yeah. I mean, I got to see Bob, and we got to see Connor Bedard. Yeah. You know, so it was super. It was fun. It was different. Yeah. So what's the big news? What's the elephant in the room? Oh, my God. The elephant in the new room is we got rid of nine players. We got rid of nine players in two days. The big news, Jonathan Marcheseau was traded to Nashville. Alec Martinez went to Chicago. William Carrier was traded to the Carolina Panthers. Logan Thompson, where did he go? To the Capitals. Right. Hey, we play them November 17th. They'll be here. Oh, November man. Yep. So we got to go over on Logan's side on warm-ups November 17th. We will for sure. Oh, um, guess who plays on my birthday? Who? The VGK versus the Wild. What? Yeah. I get to see <laughs> Flurry. Yep. Flurry will be there. Yeah. Yay. That's amazing. So who else did we lose? Oh, my God. Paul Carter. Carter. Traded to the Devils, Anthony Mantha traded to Calgary, and Amadio to Ottawa. Wow. So VGK also announced two uh, two year contracts for Caden Korzak and Pavel Dorofiev. So those are good. We got to keep those. We lost nine players in two days. Yeah, sure. That's how hockey works. That's the nature of the business. Blah, blah, blah. We want what's best for our team. We want what's, what's best for these guys. And these are the guys that won the cup for us. So it's not just love that makes us sad. They won us the cup. So why would we want to get rid of them? That's why people are upset, you know. Sure, it's hockey. That's what that's what happens, right? Yeah, super sad. I mean, I'm sad that Logan is leaving. But if he wanted to go, then I wish him the best of luck. If it was Aiden, I probably would be devastated. <laughs> yeah, unless he wanted to go too. I mean... Yeah, Marchi got a deal, got a good deal, you know. He he got more money, and he has to go where the money is. So um, we also got a few new players that we'll spotlight um, starting on our next episode. So um, I went to the VGK website today, snooping around for any news or info to share on the podcast, and all of these guys' names are gone, sis. Off the roster area, they're gone. Oh, my God. I know. It's like the body's not even cold yet. Oh. 
So yeah, it, total it, shock. They just kept saying uh, Stevenson traded, and I'm like, and they just kept popping up, and I'm like, are you kidding me right now? Wow. Oh my god. So it's okay to be upset about the players' VGK loss. It doesn't necessarily mean that you aren't going to support the team that VGK puts on the ice in the fall. So can we please stop telling people how to be a real fan? I mean, come on, everyone out there. Hey, I'm following Logan to the Capitals. I'm yeah. not going to stop watching him or supporting him because he's on a different team. Right, but you're still going to be VGK all the way for the yeah. Cup. Yeah, VGK all the way, and Logan, too. No kidding. <laughs> right. Well, if he goes and we don't, then good for him, you know. So hey, he if, got... he sh if he shuts us out, I won't be mad. <laughs> <laughs> well, I will. <laughs> <laughs> you got any upcoming events? Yes. Yeah, so July 5th, there's a meet and greet with Keegan Colazar. Yay, Keegan. He's so nice. I love this guy. This one is at the Honda West, 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. at 7615 West Sahara Avenue, Las Vegas, Nevada, 89110. Contact us, contact them at 855-742-1007, and you get free snacks. Right. And then some of the upcoming meet and greets um, that are for the Battle of Vegas featuring guys that have been traded we haven't heard of any cancellations or anything so we're going to still cover those until we hear otherwise and if they do cancel we will let you know so july 6 meet alec martinez we got to go meet alec martinez 12 p.m to 1 30 finley honda centennial hills 7494 west azure drive las vegas nevada free food and drinks um those bite-sized snacks so see you there yeah i we gotta go because i don't have him on my jersey yet I know I never met him, and he's a Michigander, so I got to go give him a high five and thank him for all he's done. Okay, July 11th, meet and greet with Brendan Brisson. This one's cool. Yeah. Hey, sis, you have to go meet him, too, because he's a little cutie pie. Oh, he is cute. Yeah, 530 to 730, and it's free at Finley Nissan Henderson, and is having a first responder and nurses appreciation day on July 11th. Find their Facebook account for details. Most importantly, you can meet with new Vegas Golden Knights favorite, Brisson. So, yep, meet and greet with Brendan Brisson from 5.30 to 7 at Finley Nissan Henderson at 295 Auto Mall Drive in Henderson, Nevada, 89014 on July 11th. Also, I'll listen to this. Also, July 11th in Scriptographs is hosting meet and greet. Logan Thompson, stay safe yeah. for his farewell. 6 p.m. to 7.30. Tickets are on sale um, at inscriptographs.com. And someone I know is going. Yay. Thank you, Stack the Pad goaltending. <laughs> yeah, they're going to send my sister. So good for you because you need to go and give give Logan a big hug. And Oh, this time I'm giving him a hug. Right. Yeah, I'm going to ask him, can I give you a hug, dude? You don't understand. Like, yeah, I post videos of you every single day. <laughs> wow, you'll probably know what you're talking about. So that's yeah. July 11th and also July 13th, Battle for Vegas. That's the yeah. 2024 charity softball game against the Raiders and the Vegas Golden Knights. Fifth annual Battle for Vegas um, is at the Las Vegas Ballpark. Tickets are on sale. Head to Ticketmaster and get yours. So that's super exciting, too. That's so coming the up. Vegas, the Vegas Golden Knights announced the team's annual Vegas Golden Knights road trip through its television Territory from August 1st through 8th, the 2024 VGK road trip will visit Jackson, Wyoming, Billings, Montana, Coeur d'Alene, and Boise, Idaho, and Reno, Nevada. All areas that can watch locally broadcast VGK games on Script Sports and their Nighttime Plus. The road trip will feature members of the Golden Knights organization participating in a series of on-ice hockey clinics and meet and greets with fans in each city. Chansey, yay! <laughs> I love him. Members of the VGK cast and team broadcasters will be among those on the trip. Visit the VGK official website for more details. Did you see that joke going around that we traded Chance? I posted it on my Instagram. Yeah. <laughs> that was funny. People were like, what the heck? I know. And at first I was like, you got to be kidding me. And I'm like, this is a joke. 
So well, yeah. of course, yeah. We yeah, it's totally funny. I'm like, they're trading a mascot. <laughs> well, it sounds like McCrimmon would consider it. So anyway, the team announced their opening night game, October 9th, 2024 versus Colorado Avalanche. Let the battle begin. It's the golden age. And the whole 2024-25 schedule has been released to the public. So go visit goldenknights.com and click on schedule. Got any news? So Nick Holden is one of the coaches on the ice for this week's camp. He was a VGK from 2018 to 2021. So good to see you, Nick. Yeah, way to go. Everyone's loving seeing Nick. So fans attending T-Mobile Arena during the preseason will receive an exclusive player pin at each of the four home games. Players featured at on the giveaway set includes Thomas Hurdle, William Carlson, Mark Stone, and Noah Hannafin, and goaltender Aiden Hill. Isn't it ironic that we have these guys that did not get traded? Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I just else- thought about that. Yeah. Yeah. That's kind of weird. And then to complete the set, the fifth player and final pin will be given away for the team's first home game of the regular season. You know it's going to be Jack Eichel, right? Jack Eichel or Mark Stone. They already said Mark Stone's going to be one of the preseason giveaways. Oh. (laughs) So, yeah. Uh um, Oh, yeah. Okay. (laughs) VegasGoldenKnights.com and click on schedule for details. So City National Arena has a boatload of hockey clinics, trainings, and camps coming up. Be sure to get yourself or your kids signed up. Visit CityNationalArena.com. Yep, and there's also a VGK development camp going on right now with all of our prospects scrimmaging at City National Arena. So if you're bored, you want to get some cool air and give them a call at City National Arena and check out the VGK development camp, 702-902-4904. Or follow VGK on X for details. Um, My sister was watching them scrimmage today on YouTube, so check it out. Yeah, it was cool. It was live. Awesome. So breaking news, Jack Eichel will represent Team USA at the Four Nations Face-Off. The Four Nations Face-Off will be a round-robin tournament featuring teams comprised of NHL players from the United States, Canada, Sweden, and Finland. Golden Knights forward Jack Eichel was one of the first six players named to USA's roster for the event, which will take place in Boston and Montreal from February 12th to The 20th NHL All-Star Weekend will not be held in 2024 or 2025 season. Why? Oh, my God. We just read that as like a fine print. The NHL will not be having a 24-25 All-Star Weekend. That sucks. That's one of the funnest times we had over here in Vegas for All-Star Weekend. Yeah, that does suck. So. All right, the VGK Foundation is in the news for awarding grants to 25 different organizations in the Las Vegas Valley that support education and youth sports, military and first responders, and health and wellness. So way to go, VGK Foundation. Derek England is a big part of that, so way to go, team. So if you want to talk to us, share info, send in additions or corrections, please do not hesitate to contact us. Fill out the Contact Us link at the bottom of our website, www.vegashockeygirls.com or mail, email us at vegashockeygirls at gmails.com. <laughs> you said gmails. <laughs> to the guys. You got a message for the guys? Man, we're going to miss all nine of you. Yeah. And for the ones that are staying, can't wait to see you. Yeah. We'll be keeping an eye on you guys. Um, Thanks, everyone, for listening. I hope everyone's doing good after losing all these players. But we'll be okay. We will bounce back and go. Go, Knights, go. go. All right. Talk to you later. Bye.